Okay, good. No. It got dark again. Okay. But, um, I'm gonna do a... I wanted to do a live stream about this, but... Technology is not being my friend right now. Um... Um... But... The GoFundMe is, like... It's insane. I'm, I don't know how to, else to describe it. Um... We're just blown away by all the support we're getting... Because what 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 are we at now? I know this isn't live, but we're gonna do it as live as possible here. Thirty-four thousand four hundred forty-seven dollars. What? Forty-three. Yeah, forty-three thousand. You said thirty-four. Sorry. What, what was it? You messed me up. Thirty-four. Uh, you, you, you said it again. Forty-three thousand four hundred forty-four. $447. I don't even know what you just said. 43447. 43447. She, she's like dyslexic. I don't know what the, what her problem is. But uh, it's insane when it, all the support we're getting. It's, it, all, all this is totally going to help out the entire family. Not just me, the entire family. This It's crazy. Because we're going to be able to pay off bills that we never thought we'd freaking pay off it in years. My parents are going to pay off credit card bills and other types of bills that they need to get taken care of. Because they said they don't want to, but like they need to because they're, they're in debt pretty bad. So we need to... I, I want to get them taken care of. Because they, they always, they've always taken care of me and I... I want to take care of them for once, so, and I, I can kind of do that with your guys' help, of course, but none of this would be possible without any of you guys, um, but to, to anybody that's still worried about the van, do not worry about that, that, that is going to take care of tenfold, um, there's, there's a guy, Ryan Sieber, he's taking care of us big time. And I'm not going to go into details because I don't really know if he, he wants me to like spell out all the details that's going on. But just just know we're getting taken care of it and we'll have nothing to worry about ever again. That's that's what he told me. As I'll never have to worry about anything ever again. So, um, yeah, I'm sorry for the dark video. I don't know what, why it's dark because there's a light right above me. So I don't know why it's dark. Let me, let me move a little bit closer here. Is it not that didn't even work? That just made it worse. Alright. <laughs> well, um, okay, here's what we'll do. So I think, it's a weird, I get good light in my, in my freaking bathroom, which is stupid. It probably because there's four freaking lights in there. But, um, I shouldn't really be driving and doing this. Um, Yay, successfully did it. Okay, thank you. I didn't get to my face. Anyway, so the van is taken care of by this time. Well, not this time next week, but by, um, what is today? I don't even know what today is. Basically, in two weeks, I'll have the van back and then some. And I'll explain that in a later video. Because probably this weekend, I'm... We're probably going to start buying equipment, camera, microphone, stuff like that. And I've been offered a new PC by somebody, so I'm going to get a kick-ass new PC. It's going to be fucking awesome. I, I know I shouldn't cuss, but it's going to be, literally, it's going to be awesome. And it's insane, because I'll be able to do so much stuff with that. Because this guy is going to hook me up, he said he's going to... Hook me up big time, and, and I've been talking to him, so... Reddit is like the god of the internet. I'm telling you people right now, Reddit... That, that's where that's where it is. That's that's where this is. I'm, I'm not even kidding. If it wasn't for Reddit and the community of nice, generous people... This wouldn't be a thing. Like... I don't even... This doesn't feel real to me, guys. Like... 
two weeks ago, two weeks ago, I I was losing hope that I would ever get the man fixed, and now I won't have to worry about it ever again, ever. That's insane to me. That's insane to me. I I couldn't sleep the entire day today, and I slept like three hours, but I'll, I'll sleep good tonight because all this stuff is. Is finally sunk in, and it's just crazy because not only that, I'm gonna be doing media interviews with local TV stations, may maybe some national ones. I don't know yet because I got contacted by some some lady in Washington, D but I think she's from Washington D D D.C. I think I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure she contacted me. And was like, would you want to be on ABC Morning News? And I'm like, yeah, and and she was like, would you want me to give them your email? I'm like, yeah, I want to get in contact with them because that would be amazing to just know, to, so I can tell people how much they've touched our lives. It's like I don't I don't even think that will even measure the scope of what's been done on Reddit. You guys don't, I can't even, um, like, say into words what this is going to do for our family and for my, my future family, because if everything goes well, we, my wife and I could possibly get a house within the next year or two. That's, that's our pipe dream goal, but, like, now that's not a, really a pipe dream anymore, if, if this keeps up the way it is, it's going to be insane. And I, I don't know what to do. It's, it's a lot to take in. And I'm not going to cry in, but like, because I already cried once again today with my dad. So... And you saw... You all saw the live stream. I... Baldwin Lucas Starker gave the eight hundred dollar donation, which I did get in touch with him. In the future, we're gonna to try to meet up and shoot the breeze, which is gonna be really freaking cool. That guy is super cool. So shout out to you, Luke. You're, you're awesome, dude. I love you, brother. You're you're just you and your wife are freaking amazing. I I can't believe the generosity of people around the world. And yes, I know there's haters. To all those people that back me up, don't don't be like, don't be like going after these people and trying to like harm them physically or something. Don't try to like find where they live and harm them. Just just leave them alone. That's what I do. Just ignore. Because I don't. I've been on YouTube for nine years, and I've dealt with everything under the sun. So I'm not. Worried about what all the trolls and weirdos say out there. So don't worry about that. But um, I just want you guys to know that this is going to mean a lot to us. I keep forgetting that the front camera is right here. <laughs> um, but it's going to mean we're going to be able to do so much stuff that we never would ever be able to afford ever. It's, I, it's, it's crazy, I, I'm laughing because I'm so freaking excited, like, I can do so much content now for you guys, when I get everything together, when, and when I get, when I get more space down there, because down, down in the room with my, they're, they're gonna move my older brother up because we share the room right now, they're gonna move him upstairs because, my younger brother's moving out, so I'm going to have that whole room to myself, basically. Which is going to be, like, insane, because then I can do live streams or videos once once a day, at least. Or, like, maybe, like, twice a week. I, I'll try to work out a schedule when I can, but right now, I, I don't know what it's going to be like. But, speaking of gaming, I, I will be getting a Switch. I know someone said get a switch 
And my dad was joking. He's like, well, I guess you're going to get your Switch. And I was like, well, uh, yeah, because I'm going to do an unboxing video and all that good stuff that people like to see. And I'll do my first thoughts on it. Because I think you guys will like to see, and maybe Nintendo would like to see, thoughts on a, on their new system from the perspective of a disabled person. Even though I don't see myself disabled, but I am disabled. But I think they would think that's cool if they would see it and be like, hey, this this system actually works well for disabled people in this same situation. So we could try to market it towards them too. Or maybe they could they could come to me with ideas on how to market it better towards disabled people. I don't know. Who knows? That might lead to something. I don't know. But because I'm a huge fan of Nintendo and that's what I grew up on. So I definitely going to get a Switch and get to play some Breath of the Wild or or Kart 8 or something, or Ultra Street Fighter 2, I think that's what Street Fighter game's called. Um, and may maybe I'll get Bomberman, because I like Bomberman too, so it's going to be a cool game. And when uh, Xenoverse 2 comes out, Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2, I'm going to get that, because it's Dragon Ball, come on, you guys know I'm a freaking Dragon Ball nerd. I have to get it. So, um, this video's running kind of long, so... I don't know how long it's gonna go, so let me go for it. So, um, so, um, what else do I want to talk about? Oh, and if you guys want to meet me, if any of my want to meet me in person, contact like gaming conventions around like too many games for next year because this year wouldn't be possible probably because it's literally next Friday and I doubt they'd be able to book a hotel unless they could. Somehow magically get me a room within a week, but I highly doubt that they'd be able to scrunch something together. But if that would be possible, that'd be great because I would love to thank uh, Pat Country because Pat Country actually retweeted um, the GoFundMe page when I tweeted. I'm like, hey, dude, can you can you give this a little retweet if if at all possible? And like 20 minutes after I did it, he did it, and I was like, holy crap, Pat and Aspen just retweeted what I asked. And that usually never happens to me. Like, I'm just an average dude. Like, stuff like this don't happen to me. So, it's really humbling to see this happen. But, yeah, I, I love to meet some of you guys. And I, I love to, like, sign some stuff for you. If you got, like, weird, like, tire electronic stuff. Or, like, I don't know t-shirts or something and um I don't know something I don't I don't I don't know what kind of stuff you want me to sign but I, I'd sign whatever I can't sign very well but I can sign but I guess with practice I get better at it because I normally don't sign my name too much but I can but I'll get better at it as I do it but um so if you guys want to see me at any kind of gaming convention you, you have to let either too many games know it like SoCal Gaming, there's there's a lot out there. That you could let them know, hey, I want to I want to meet this guy. Can you try to get him? And hopefully they'll contact me and find me out. And hopefully you guys will. And by then I'll do a live stream and let you guys know, hey, I'm gonna be here. Start bringing your stuff because I'm gonna be signing everything I can. And um, maybe. Oops, my bad. Okay, that was good. I'm, I was itching my nose and I inadvertently pressed the button. I'll just combine the videos and that will be fine. Uh, but I was saying, I would, I, would, I would sign everything or anything you guys pay, I would sign. And if I ever sign anything, make sure it's nothing like weird. Like, I don't want to be signing like people's chests or nothing crazy. I mean, I, I will, I will as a joke, maybe, but try to keep it <laughs> normal. But I'll do some joke signs if you want, or I'll do the approved toy for I'll, I'll make like I'll do that since I did that during the live stream. I know, I know people like that when I did that. Um, but yeah, I really, I really would like to thank Pat Contra. So if you guys could like, like, 
tweet him or something, tweet this video at him or something, I would love to do like, I don't know, maybe a podcast episode talking about myself. I don't know, maybe maybe you would want to do that, I don't know. I'd have to talk to him. God, that'd be weird to talk to him, but that'd be cool. But, um, there's just so much stuff in my head right now that I'm thinking about. Um, and this is a little bit of a request from someone out there that might be good with doing intros. Because I've always wanted to do, do, like, a video intro. Like, you know how people do, like, intros with, like, off the top of my head, like, D.B. Santo. He has a cool little intro of a flaming dragon. And it says D.B. Santo. I want to do something like that for my channel. Like, something cool. So if someone can help me out with some kind of cool intro to put with every video I do, that would be really cool. If I could get a custom-made intro and stuff. That would be insane, because that would be like, oh, this is one of his videos. Because th- they would recognize the, in- the intro. Like some rocket intro, or something. Something something that screams handle games and gaming in general is what I'm really looking for. But um, it'd, be, cause it'd be cool to have my little intro thing. Um, but that's a little request for me. So, so if, you, if you want to help me with that... Contact me on my um, Facebook page, and I'll get back to you as soon as I get. My, it's blowing up, so it's, it's gonna be a while before I get back because my email is blowing up with interviews and all that stuff. Like I said, so it's gonna take a while for me to respond to everybody, but I'll try my best because it's I'm getting so big of a response. It's hard to keep up with it. You guys are like amazing. Like it's. Crazy. I don't know what to do with all the love. It's it's insane. It's crazy. You guys are gonna make me cry again. Actually that was Lucas that did that, but <laughs> that's beside the point. But um let's see what else. So yes, the go the go find me if you we're gonna leave it up for a good while to see if people wanna still help us out because believe me this will help. Because anything helps. Five dollars helps. That's what most of the donations were. That's why it kept going up so fast. Is we got little, little five dollar donations and those add up quick. So those helped. Those little, little five dollar, ten dollar donations, those helped. So if you guys want I'll leave a link to, to the GoFundMe again in the page. And the same guy, I don't remember your name on Reddit. I, sorry, I don't remember it, but if you see it, you can post on Reddit again. And if if you want to donate, that's fine. If you, if you don't, that's fine too. Just, just know that the money is going towards helping me and my family. But once the family stuff's done, it's all going to go towards... The channel and stuff. Once we get all the credit card stuff paid off and all that, it's going to go towards getting us a house and then, well, not that first, but getting me equipment for YouTube and then hopefully getting us a down payment for a house. But that's like my pipe dream. Will that happen? I don't know. Could it happen? Who know? Who knows? With the power of Reddit, I don't know. I, I don't know what Reddit can do. I, I'm blown away. Reddit can do... Reddit can do what Reddit can do. Like, I don't even know like what Reddit can do. It's crazy. So, I, I'm, I'm going to wrap up this video by saying I love you all so much, and I, and I mean that sincerely. I truly do love each and every 20,000... Subscriber, I have, or however many I have now. I'm going to say 20,000 because I'm just going to round it up because I don't know what's going to be at by the time this goes live. Um, but I really do appreciate all of you guys' support over the years. Anybody that's been surrounded for the nine years I've been here, thank you for sticking around. Thank you for being patient. I know my video quality hasn't always been the best. Especially when I first saw it, I was using that old 
really crappy camera that was really crappy. So when I get good stuff, if you guys want, I will re-upload some of my crappier quality videos. But you guys have to have to make sure those get watched because if they get watched, I will delete the the other ones so those don't exist anymore. But that's that's once I get an HD camera. If you guys want that to happen, like I'll update some of my crappier um, quality games of games I still have. Like some of the games I don't have anymore because I've sold them to make room because I'm running out of room down here. So, um, but thank you all so much. Thank you, Pat and the S Punk for the retweet. Thank you, Lucas. Thank you, Ryan Seabird. I hope I'm pronouncing your name right, by the way. But it's just thank you all. That's my left hand in case I really can't turn it too well. But I just, if I could, I would. I would look like a hug each and every one of you right now. I would. I would do it right now. I would. I would hug each and every one of you. Every one of you. I would. Hug and probably never, never, never let go because this is life changing for me. And I can't wait to see what's going to happen in the future. And I'll keep you guys updated with all the interviews. I'll see if I can get permission from like the news channels to upload them on my channel. I don't see why I wouldn't be able to when it deals with me and I'm the one that runs the channel. So. I don't see why that would be an issue. We might have to pay them to do that, but that wouldn't be an issue either. I don't I don't know how that would work, but I'm going to cross that bridge when I get to it. So, you guys will see the interviews, hopefully. If not, I can, I can easily make a video like this and link you like their article. And I'm sure they'll post videos online where you can watch if I can get a raw video of it and post it to my channel. But I hope they'll let me do that. That shouldn't be an issue. I think that would be possible. But I'm going to wrap this video up by, by saying I really hope I get to meet some of you someday. So if you want me to be at Too Many Games next year as a guest, because I will be going there no matter what next year, even if I'm not a guest, even if I'm just some random mingler, some random average Joe guy, I'm still going to go. But if you guys would, 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 would want me to be excuse me, a guest, um, just start emailing too many games, going on the forum and doing the guest request thing or whatever it is. I don't know because I don't really know too much about that. But, um, because I would love to meet all of you guys that have subscribed to me and been with me. And, I, and it's just, it's just, Amazing, what what's happened over the, over this whole week, these past twenty four hours, I should say. Like, it, we're, we're, this isn't over, guys. This is it's just begun to get crazy. So, I'm gonna keep you guys updated as well as I can, cause I'm, I'm gonna get a new phone here soon. I know. I'm gonna see if I can get one. Probably by Friday, because this phone it sucks, and then I'll be able to do YouTube live whenever, and I can just do it on my phone. Cause my phone only runs like Android 4.0 or something. It's old. It needs 6.0 to do it. So I hope I won't have any issues with that once I get a new phone. I shouldn't. But um, cause I will be doing live streams probably every day. Cause they're fun. I had fun doing that. Even though it made me cry, but I still had fun doing it. It was fun seeing all you guys comment and talk about the Metro and stuff like that. And I'm talking too much again. I, I like to ramble a lot. I know I, I do that a lot. Um, but I just want to make sure I, you guys know this means a lot to me. Or means a lot to me and my family. And, and of course, I have to give a big, huge shout out to, to my friend. Desi, she's basically my sister, so I'm, I'm just going to say my sister, Desi, we, we grew up together, so if it wasn't for her guys, none of this would have happened, so Desi, 
left-handed kiss. Love you. Uh, <laughs> even though, even though I was always a turn when I was growing up, but you really came through for us. So it's I'll never be able to repay you for what you did for us. And I know my mom and dad are are just as flabbergasted by everything. Cause I would love for them to be on the video, but they're tired. They're, they're asleep. They've been up for so long. They're, they need rest. So do I. But oh, I'm fine. I can I can run off four hours of sleep easy. So um. So um, okay. Um. But yeah, to reiterate, if you guys, if, I will be at too many games next year. Not as a guest, as of yet. If they contact me, you guys will be the first to know. Because I do want to go to a convention of some sort. Now, I will be going to Missouri again, like I mentioned earlier. I don't know if I mentioned it in the video. But I will be going there. So if you're in the Columbus area or want to travel to the Columbus area, I'll leave a link to the... It's already got a page, and where you can find out where where their address is, and where it's it's in Columbus, Ohio. I'm not sure the address are off the top of my head, but if you guys want to come up there and see me, of course I won't be guest because it's a, it's an anime con. But if you, if you all want to come up there and see me, if some of you want to travel, um, that'd be up to you. But I'll be I, I would be really excited. To see some of you, if, you, if some of you actually show up there, because that'd be really cool. Um, but I will be, I will be at Mitzvah again this year, probably every year for for a while. Um, so yeah, if you want to meet me there, come to Columbus, Ohio, and I'll leave a description to the Mitzvah on page in the description below. And plus, I guess I'm gonna leave a link to my Facebook page, my Patreon. Um, the PayPal account, which the PayPal account, that 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 will be for ordering stuff on eBay, GameStop's website, stuff that stuff that uses PayPal to like pay for. So I can just start buying stuff I need, like equipment or or handle games or games for Switch or whatever, whatever I would need. I already have like eighty dollars because people would donate to that. You don't have to do the Patreon if you don't want to. Because I really don't know how that works. And I really don't know if I'll be able to upkeep with that. If someone wants to help me run my channel, that would be great. Contact me about that because I would love to have like another admin administrator or something. Because I will probably need the help with allocating some of the comments and Dealing with spam and stuff, uh, all that stuff. So yeah, it's gonna be, it's gonna be a journey for a while, but I'll get it all squared away. We'll get it figured out, and I'll keep you guys surprised. So be sure to like this this video and share it if you want, and comment. And I'll leave a link to everything in the description. And thank you guys so much. And I hope to see you soon, somewhere, sometime. So, uh, final thoughts here. Um, um, I'm just, I just, I just don't know what final thoughts I could say. I've pretty much said everything I can say. But like I said, if you guys want to meet me, I will be at Mitzurkon, not as a guest, as just. A person there, walking around, well, you know what I mean by walking around, my version of walking around, I'll be riding around in, in hopefully like some weird souped up chair that we're, that we're probably going to wind up getting, I don't know, because this chair is getting pretty old, and I know insurance would cover that, but, but we're also going to look into getting an affordable chair for like, so if I have to fly... Like a foldable power chair, because they make those. And so if I have to fly somewhere, I can take that on a plane. Wouldn't be a problem. Because my wife can easily pick me up. And by the way, to all the people that... 
Like, say my wife hits me and stuff. That's what we do, like... She loves me and I love her. No, she's not being abusive in any way. We slap each other. We we love joking around like that. You just say the kind of crap we do. We, we're, we're crazy. We're crazy, crazy people. We're crazy, crazy people. We're... we're well, we are more now with all this support. But... Trust me, my wife is a good person. She... She never hurts me intentionally. I mean, every now and then I'll bump my head when she picks me up, puts me in the in the van that we're driving now. But it's, not, it's never on purpose. She never tries to hurt me. So just be kind to my wife because it, it really bothers me when people go after her because it's I don't want you guys going after, people going after my wife. So, just just keep all your neg negativity towards me. I don't, cause it doesn't affect me. I don't care. So, just thank you guys so much. And I hope to see you guys soon. And I can't wait to do some more live streams for you guys. But, uh, take care guys. Peace out.